Top Democrats are pushing back against a wealthy Minnesota man who knowingly took food stamps to prove the program has too many loopholes. State House Republicans are advancing a bill to tighten up who's eligible for the food benefits. But it's causing a lot of anger from supporters who say it's presenting an unfair picture of who goes hungry in Minnesota. Our Pat Kessler is at the Capitol tonight. Pat? Yeah, half a million Minnesotans are on the Supplemental Assistance Nutrition Program. We call it food stamps, and they're on that every single year. But there is a millionaire from Waite Park who said he was on food stamps, too. Rob Undersander says he had little income on paper, but a million dollars in assets. But he applied for food stamps and got them. But because Minnesota does not count those savings, I'm allowed to siphon unneeded welfare benefits. Food stamps are based on income only, but a new bill would change that to also include assets like property and retirement accounts. Well, he finagled the system. Minnesota Governor Mark Dayton says there's not widespread waste in the program, and the millionaire ought to be ashamed. I mean, one person can gain the system. We're talking about hundreds of millions of people that are on these, these programs. And they find one person who who's figure out how to game the system. Nearly half a million Minnesotans received food stamp benefits. 69% of them are families with children. And 33% are seniors or disabled. Some lawmakers were offended. You knew this was wrong. And you did it anyway. And frankly, I find this pretty despicable. I'm actually just sorry there's no way we can prosecute you, to be honest. Food stamp use has gone up in recent years, and supporters of means testing say it's going to make the program more effective. Help me cor correct and put the right guidelines in here to make sure those that don't need it don't get it. And those that are in need do get it. Uh, the Minnesota millionaire who got those food stamps applied for him didn't do anything illegal. He says he got about $300 a month for 19 months. That amounts to almost $6,000 a year. Now, the average food stamp recipient in Minnesota gets about $200 a month. That's about a buck 40 a meal. So he says he's trying to make a point, and a lot of legislators here want to know what that point is, and they're pretty worked up about this tonight. Yeah, an amazing story. Thank you, Pat. You bet. If you want to see Pat's reality check on the food stamp program, go to WCCO.com slash reality check. He's got more on President Trump's proposal to overhaul the program for needy families.